Yes. Well, let's discuss this some more. Uh, joining me is the Pakistani journalist Shahid Qureshi. Uh, Shahid, for anyone looking in from the outside at this incredible saga, this ongoing development uh, day after day, uh, what are they to make of it? What is going on? Well, Pakistan is a place of uh, happening uh, and things happening, uh, I hope, in the right direction. And I think uh, the politicians should show some maturity at this stage. Uh, if they keep on sending uh, candidates who have uh, criminal records or allegations of corruption, uh, one should expect this kind of uh, responses from the judiciary. One shouldn't blame judiciary for or uh, any revival towards the rule of law, uh, which Pakistani politicians are unfortunately not used to it. Uh, so they better get used to it because the media is in Pakistan is quite uh, vibrant now. And uh, this is what's happening. I think President Zardari had option of out of 400 people uh, in his ca in his parliament, whom uh, he chose somebody who has a uh, allegation of uh, involvement in a multi-billion uh, ephedrine uh, scandal, uh, which was a drugs uh, uh, used and bought in Pakistan, and then it was sold uh, in Australia and other parts of the world. And the international bodies made a complaint about this okay. ephedrine. Uh, Scandal. Shahid, Shahid, very interesting that you say things are going in the right direction. Others would see this as the judiciary uh, overstepping its its powers, overstepping it, the mark, and are, are talking about a sort of coup, judicial coup. Uh, I mean, there's a completely different way of looking at that, isn't there? Because some see this as a vendetta against the ruling party, the PPP. Well, I think the PPP is uh, really quite feeling quite insecure. They, this is the, their fifth term in the history of Pakistan. Benazir Bhutto was in power t twice. Benazir's father was a prime minister twice. And if I include the, Mr. Bhutto was a foreign minister during the Yub Khan and now Mr. Zardari is in power for uh, four years, past four and a half years. So the Pakistani people have elected People's Party uh, many occasions. They have given them enough chances and fifth chance is a is a quite uh, a lot. Normally, people say third time lucky, but they, this is their fifth term, and I don't I don't know why they're complaining about. They instead of looking in into their in-house, uh, they're they're trying to divert this uh, towards the to the people or to the, the judiciary. This government has taken loan uh, from the international bodies and inside the Pakistani banks more than anyone in the history of Pakistan, which is more than about 2,000 uh, million or billion uh, rupees. Uh, sure. So it's, it's their corruption, misgovernance, which is sure. an issue, and uh, not what judiciary is doing to them. Shahid Qureshi, we must leave it there. Thank you very much indeed, the UK correspondent for the Pakistan newspaper Frontier Post. Thank you.